happen like that? Hit this area with 51. Everything in the butterflies. Go get your man. And I feel like butterfly gonna be captain. So all y'all wanna know what happened, I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. I'm catching it, etching it, sketching it, stretching it. I'll pour a little gas up on the bed and then I'm revving it. This is excellent. Hope he's home. Cut the, cut the, cut the, cut the music, man. Salute to every single one of the subscribers. That notification gang, the rock boys in the building tonight. I hope everybody's doing good. I hope everybody's, you know, having a good Sunday. Uh, attending church, things like that. Spending time with your family, uh, you know. Bless. I hope everybody's blessed out there. But we gotta, uh, we gotta get into some things. I know people. There were some people out there who probably did not catch Ultimate Madness. Like strippers on their period. Now that's a disgrace. No. Then why you let twerk get it popping with a red rag in your face? Oh. <laughs> and I'm gonna run through this real quick, and I'll give you my personal thoughts. My man Showtime SP is back in the building, spending time with the family and taking care of things that he needed to take care of. He thanks everybody for the condolences, etc., etc. But uh, I'll run through the card real quick and tell you who I feel like won. I do got a couple blogs coming up about certain battles and certain situations. Um, I'll do that like that. But uh, real, real quick, run through. Um, Prep versus Swave Seva. Um, I did not get to peep the whole battle, um, I, I, but I, they are coming in, but uh, i seen that a lot of people gave it to Prep, there's some people that gave it to Swave, I heard Swave Rob, Swave Rob, I have to watch that, just being, just keeping it a buck, I gotta be honest, um, Casey J versus Twerk, Twerk choked all three rounds, Casey J wasn't even the greatest Casey J that I've seen, they literally, when Drake put that 100 bands up, he put that 100 bands up as a layup to Twerk, they even switched his opponent to give him a layup versus Casey J, but a lot of y'all was picking him in the tournament, but unfortunately, he's never shown consistency. So I, I couldn't understand why would people pick someone to win a tournament that takes consistency and being prepared quick. I know he battles every day. He's probably got to battle tomorrow, and he battles Robin Rhymes like the next day, but this type of level, on the highest level, that, that preparation was nasty. He choked all three rounds, and it's it's always the if. What if, 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 if. Um, I seen Av tweet today, we got to stop talking about if. It either is or it ain't. And right now, it ain't. And I ain't going to bash him too much, but it ain't. Moving along. Uh, drugs versus Yoshi G. I don't know what Yoshi was rapping about. Maybe she should have let Quantum Physics write that shit. Uh, drugs got his first win on URL. First real clear win. It was what it was. Um, Geechee Gotti, 2-1 or 3-0. He ain't even take his warm-up jacket off. Easy win. I have nothing else to say about that. Um, Jack Boy Main versus T Top. I see people saying T Top won, but Jack Boy Main won, and I will talk about that in another joint. Uh, Jack Boy Main was Jay. He was on fire. He was. He was. It was literally his best performance that I've seen him on the URL period. Uh, he had the Black Wolf sweater on. He he was wilding. He 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 was bugging to me. His third round. <sighs> Jack was in a different bag. That Jack right there is going to be hard to beat. Um, Jerry West versus Swamp. I had Swamp went into one respectfully. Uh, Jerry West had some shit, but, but Swamp, he said something about him. Broke down more dimes than Kevin Sant. Come on, son. Come on, son. What? Swamp found himself, man. Uh, Cortez versus Official. Uh, Cortez, uh, he looked like Joel Ortiz. Once Cortez starts gaining mad weight, son, he need to get on the gym's plan and stop eating dirty junk. You know, I've been doing my four or five miles a day, bro. It's, you're, you're nasty, but you're nasty. And you was very nasty. He said, I have Mexicans with the tools in front of your home deep old body bag. Uh, I don't know what official was rapping about. Uh, she choked in the third and she was like, she, I don't know. It was bad. But anyway, I got my man Showtime SP, man. Welcome. Welcome, my brother, back with open arms. Let's get this thing started. Gang, 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 little bang. Had to get that moment of silence for my pop and law, you feel me? Rest in peace, and I appreciate all of the condolences, and I appreciate all of that love. You know what I'm saying? It's difficult when you lose a loved one. 
it's even more difficult when it's somebody that's close to you. So definitely reach out to everybody out there. Check on your friends. Check on your strong friends. Check on your family. Make sure everybody's good. Make sure that your family is intact because no matter what, family comes first. I right? just want y'all to know that. And I love and I appreciate Every single one of y'all, 70,000 subscribers. Y'all niggas be looking. Y'all niggas be looking and sharing and subscribing. Y'all niggas be liking. I like that, and I appreciate that. And every single time I turn on this camera, I think about this. I think about it. It's for y'all, man. It's for y'all, man. We need to talk, though. But before we do any of that, it's your boy Showtime SP to nobody that knows bodies. Bah! Ultimate Madness 3. Ultimate Madness 3. Let's talk about it. Hmm? 100K is on the line. Hmm. 100K on the line. Yeah, that's ill. But for 100K, some of y'all niggas should have just tilled. You should have stayed in the crib. I was going to have a line to rhyme with that, but I decided to just say, fuck it. What's good, y'all? Let's talk about it. We're going to have to run this all the way down. We got a lot of things that we need to speak about, so I'm going to just go ahead and just dive right on in here. Let me, let me, let me, let's start from the top. Let's start from the tippy top. Oh, my people. Drugs versus Yoshi. Mm. Mm. First battle of the night. The one that should have been lopsided, right? The one that, ah, maybe Yoshi could come out of this one unscathed. Why? Because drugs don't win battles. Drugs don't win. Drugs is going to get smoked by Yoshi. A couple weeks, a couple days ago, I'm hearing, now we hearing lines from Yoshi. But, but, but they came from QP, so we're going to have to break down the QP. But I don't have an ounce of belief for you niggas. QP outs for you niggas. I should have been in this tournament is what I'm telling you niggas. <sighs> All right, let me chill. Um, drugs smoked Yoshi. I'm going to say that one more time. Drugs smoked Yoshi. All three rounds. No debating that one law, that, that one and, and, and 35. No, you had to add that too on to drugs' record when this battle drops on the app. Next battle. Prep versus Sway. Sway feels like he was robbed. I feel like Prep kind of got that battle. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm not disagreeing with any any of these battle choices because, one, I'm not a judge. Y'all didn't choose me. And I'm glad y'all didn't because this battle was very difficult to figure out. I feel like Prep, bar-wise, was a lot better. But Swave in the real talk, he said, matter of fact, you look like the nigga that robbed me and I need to finish the job. Swave, I was feeling that. But I don't feel like that was a 100K worth. I'm just saying, I just I just feel like it wasn't a 100K worth, Swave. Anybody that's way realer, like that, that could be in the streets and all that, and the violation styles and all that, I can understand if y'all got Swave winning it. I can understand that. But me personally, I did like prep bars better. I really like prep's real talk rounds now to people in the first round. That means we're going to get that out the window. Thing about you, prep, is you go so hard in that first that it kind of lets off the gas. It's not as impactful in the second and the third. But I do like how you be on it, though. I like that energy, prep. You can go far if you do the same thing, but just tweak everything. Next battle. I'm sorry, I had prep winning 2 1, but they already said prep got that battle, so I'm gonna just say that. <laughs> we wanted to get on the body there with that. Cortez versus official. Oh my god. Ernesto. Hmm? Hmm? Ernesto. Hmm, muy bien. Muy bien. Muy bien. Mm hmm? Tres y cero. Tres y cero. Hmm? Three, oh. Because I know you really don't speak Spanish, so I figured I had to say it. I know you understand. You get what I'm saying. Cortez. Sir. Honey K word. Yes. En energy. Yes. Bars. Yes. I need all that. 
I need all that every single time. I need that. I need all that next round. And you got a chance to get far. But you probably won't have to go up against Cortez. I don't know if they're going to switch the brackets up. But I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Cortez was cooking. All right? Jerry West versus Swamp probably was the closest battle. The closest battle. It's probably the closest battle. I'm not going to lie to you. It's, it's definitely up there for battle of the night. Because... Me personally, I think I edged Jerry maybe the first and the third, but the fans got Swamp winning. And here's the thing. Swamp was cooking. It wasn't like it was a robbery. I'm not going to jack no robbery. I'm not going to say it was a robbery. Just saying Jerry had way more punches. But what happened was Swamp was like, okay, okay, oh, ooh, watch out for that one. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, huh, huh. Oh, see, he had the slower haymakers. Line of the night, I done broke more dimes down than Kevin Samuels. So you think I should just be giving up the coochie just because I like him? You motherfucking right. That line was fire, Swamp. 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 Just a little bit. Just, just, just a little bit. Just a little bit. Speed that pace up just a little bit more. You can continue on to this one. I kind of like the competition in this one. I feel like I feel like Vodafly going to recap this event and say this is probably the good. This is a good first round. This is a good first round. I think maybe the UM2 might have been a little bit better, but the names was, was better. The first UM was good, but we saw a lot of things falling. And we're going to get into the reason why UM3 is probably not the best first round, all right? Now. Let's get serious, okay? Let's get serious. Let's get serious and fall in love. Uh, uh, Jermaine, J never mind. Nitty, sir, I got a problem with you, Nitty. I can tell you didn't really put that much pain in on this, but you won. You won the battle. I don't care what nobody says. Serious may feel like he got robbed. Nigga, you've been robbing niggas for years, so I'm just out there. It's about time, karma. Come back around. I'm, I'm, I don't know your personal transgressions. I don't know your personal issues. So, therefore, that may, might have been a personal shot. But, once again, I'm nobody. I'm, I'm just, I'm nobody. But I do know bodies. And you didn't get body. Second round series, you was cooking. Second round, you was definitely pulling cards. And I like that shit. I liked it. I did, serious. I really did. But I feel like, Nitty, once again, in the same way I felt about Jerry West and Swamp, it was the polar opposite because Nitty just kept swinging. He just kept swinging. Series had the little, had the little pop, 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 pop. Oh, watch out for that one because that was coming. I'm just saying, I'm just saying it felt like Sirius was really trying, but the odds were stacked so much against you, so much against you that it was hard for you to even win this battle, bro. I got Nitty. I got Nitty winning this battle too. On first and the third, bro. First and the third. Geechee versus Riggs. I had Geechee winning all three rounds, but I did like Riggs third round. Okay, I did like Riggs third round. He did have the good. Uh, you uh, you battled um, Suge, Arsenal. You more of a crip killer than me. That was fire, Riggs. That was fire. But I just feel like it wasn't enough, and the judges felt the same way, and they just felt the same way. Now, here is the part of the video that if you made it this far, I appreciate y'all still watching and shit, because, you know, I'm just, this, this is just me showing love to y'all. I gotta get back to the regular life, you feel me? I'm lying. I'm doing this shit for y'all. I gotta get back to this, you feel me? Jack Boy Maine versus T-Top. Mm. Mm. You could say it's close. You could say it's close. Whoo, but Jack Boy. Jack Boy Maine. You out here fucking bracket up. You out here fucking shit up. And so now the creaky floors is something you gonna have to deal with because I like it. Whatever that energy that you had tonight in the boot blocks with the cool pops and the shoot tops, I like that shit. I like that. You keep that energy all three goddamn rounds. The next battle and the battle after that and the final battle. You could walk away with 100K. 
you, Cortez, and a uh, 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 Swamp, and Gitch, y'all niggas rapping like y'all need this 100k. Like, I feel like y'all niggas is doing what y'all need to be doing to earn this 100k. And I'm with all of that. I appreciate all of this work. T-Top. T-Top. You was doing so good in the first. But it just kept going into a decline. And that happens in a lot of your battles now, T-Top. Where your first round be so spooky that it just lets off the gas into the second and the third. And therefore, you be giving the second and the third to your opponent. And that is why I had Jack Boy Main winning this battle second and the third. You ain't, and listen, this is my opinion. Y'all can check the stats. Y'all can definitely check the stats. I feel you and all of that. You know what I'm saying? But I'm just telling y'all how I feel. I'm just, I'm just letting y'all know how I feel about that battle, okay? Jack Boy Ming really impressed me in this battle. From now on, that is how you rap. You can win 100K if you rap like that, nigga. Final battle of the night. Final battle of the night. Uh, New Jersey Twerk versus KCJ. Y'all had all night. Y'all watched seven battles go down, and then it was y'all turn. And y'all have fell against the main event curse right now. Most of these main events ain't been cooking the way that they've been cooking. And Casey, my darling, my sweetheart, my black queen, my angel, you fell victim to that. And it wasn't even your fault. Your material was good. But you know what the problem was? You know what really the problem was? We could tell you was frustrated. And we and, and, and I could tell that it bothered you all three rounds. But you should have kept your foot on that nigga's neck the whole time. You won, baby. You won. You won. You won. Congratulations. You advanced to the second round. You did what the other two girls couldn't do. It was about to look very dark for the ladies. The qu next Kings versus Queens, they wasn't even going to even have that as an idea had it not been for you, Casey. As usual, Casey, the work that you put in, you continue to progress. And I'm loving that. You know what I'm saying? Marry me. I'm never mind. I'm just saying. I just got to give Casey her flowers. Now, now, Casey, if you can, just, um, you can just walk on out the room now because, um, I gotta talk to somebody else real quick. I just. You ain't even get in the first round fully. Hmm? Hmm? You didn't think the second round was okay. Your third round was atrocious. Hmm? You gonna have to get your mans. You. I. I. And not the only one that feels this way. And if you don't believe me, you should probably read these comments down at the bottom. You you probably not going to read it because it's all hate. You probably not even going to watch this because we don't even follow each other. And apparently I'm blocked on your side. Sir, do you even give half a fuck? Do you give two fucks? Do you give a shit? Do you give anything? What motivates you? Because it clearly ain't money. What motivates you? It clearly isn't competition. What motivates you? It clearly isn't playing on a better team. If nothing motivates you, why are you here? If you got a talent... And you like to have a certain amount of power. And you know that you can use that power. But yet you choose to abuse that power. And use that power. You need to lose that power. Time after time after time, it has happened. And time after time after time, it's been a letdown. I personally... I'm just not, just not subscribing anymore. I'm not. I totally give up. I don't care about talent. I don't care about explosiveness. I care about consistency. I care about the work that's being put in. You know what I really care about? I really care about effort. 
That's why I now believe in Swamp to make it through this. Now I believe that Jack Boy is going to do something. Now I believe that Drugs is going to do something. So thank you, Twerk Sis Christ. Because your sacrifice made your team so much better. Bye.